Welcome to What is School of Languages. In this lesson, we are going to have a look at the past perfect. The past perfect. We studied the simple, the present perfect. But here, we are going to have a look at the past perfect and how it is formed. What is the past perfect? This test is used to express an action that was finished at some time in the past before another took place. It is formed by using the auxiliary verb had plus past participle of the main verb. Examples. We had swept the room when my father came. They had done their first, the work before our teacher left. I had eaten when Kwaku came from Italy. This outline was verbs here are the past perfect. You see the auxiliary verb had in the had had been added to the past participle of the verb. Now let's practice it by doing some activities as I usually do. Fill in the gap with the correct form of the verb in the past perfect tense. Examples, example. I did not know he lived. I did not know he had left. Had left. One. By the time we got to the scene, the robbers, yesterday, before I realized my phone, before we realized our expectations, yesterday by noon, our visitors. We did not know you, the person behind. And we have verbs in brackets. We are going to put those verbs in the past perfect. So we are going to add had plus the past participle. By the time we go to the scene, the Robert had escaped. The Robert had escaped. By the time we go to the scene, the Robert had escaped. Yesterday, before I realized, my phone had disappeared, had disappeared. Before we realized, our expectation had shattered. Yesterday by noon, our visitors had arrived. We did not know you had left the person behind. Okay, study them. You see that we have had plus past participle of the verb. Activity B, fill in the gap with the correct form of the verb in the past perfect tense. One, the boy was told to go by another route because a snake there. She was given another chance after she up. After he, he was rearrested for rape. After she, the solo, Everyone applauded her. Daddy tried to find out why I to call him. Until they were told to stop the kid all day. Let's put the verb in the past perfect, those in the brackets. The boy was told to go by another route because a snake had been there. She was given another chance after she had messed up. After he had released, had released, he was rearrested for rape. After she had sung the solo, everyone applauded her. Daddy tried to find out why I had refused to court him. Until they were told to stop, the kid had played all day. This is the end of the past perfect. And you can notice that we only have to add hand plus the past participle of the verb. So you should know the past participle of each verb. To be able to do this, if you don't know the past participle, you find it difficult to form the past perfect of the verb. So it means past perfect means uh, past of half, that is hat plus past participle of the verb, that's the main verb. I was very 
pleased or have been very pleased to be with your tutor in this lesson, in this class. Make sure that you don't miss the next class. You can stay ask questions in the uh, space below so that you get replies. In the next lesson, we are going to have a look at the present continuous tense. Present continuous tense or the progressive tense. Merci et au revoir. Thank you very much. Goodbye.